ask the question if I could. So, uh, in relation to price, do they know it's a recession or do they just act like regular economies? So they don't slow down even if the economy does. I just wanted to make sure. <laughs> Well, let me ask you about the question as well. Um, how much time should a, a small business owner or a business owner in general, how much time should they be uh, spending looking at budget forecasting, um, expenses, those kind of things? Well, I think it depends on definitely the business and the cycle of receiving and expenditures of cash uh, for that industry. There are some businesses that have long sale cycles that have long receivables. Hopefully they can work out payment plans so that they have payables that match that. Uh, those companies have to tend to watch uh, watch their cash flow even more so than a, than a cash type business such as retail where you're getting paid every day. Uh, I'm finding more and more that Small businesses have to continue to show and work with their banker as if their banker really is a counselor because especially in those companies that have long sales cycles, uh, that bank has got to be able to help finance that company until they start receiving their money. Uh, a retail business, we recommend that you're watching your cash flow and you're watching your budget daily. So it ranges from daily to weekly to monthly to quarterly, depending upon what industry you're in. Okay. David? I also teach my students at Nashville Tech, where I just started 17 years ago, that maybe right now we could consider a new type of business plan called the Tough Times Business Plan. And when we have great counselors like Walt Williams from SCORE, scorenox.org, right? And uh, tsbdc.org the uh, site uh, where you can reach Lil Rossini, you can find an outline on how to deal with uh, some tough times that we're in right now. But I like the idea of a tough times business plan that people update about every month. And sometimes it's even necessary more than every month mm -hmm. because things are different. We've seen some businesses in our area of Middle Tennessee that have been in existence for over 30 years and they're teetering right now. So uh, we know it's very tough out there, and I just wanted to also mention that we have $730 million to the SBA under the stimulus plan, which you can learn about at recovery.gov, $375 million for temporary fee reductions or eliminations on SBA loans, and increased SBA guarantee shares for up to 90% guarantee on SBA loans. And the other 300 and uh, some million uh, goes for various things, including technology upgrades, expanding our microloan program, which is very popular here in this area, and even $10 million to the Office of Ex Inspector General in case there's any fraud. Okay. Now, let me ask you a question. Um, do any of you have a group, I don't know that you would necessarily call it an advisory board, but do you have a group of people that you depend on to bounce ideas off of? Uh, when changes need to be made in your business. Dayton, go ahead. Um, it, it, although it's, even, it's small, but I do. Um, a year ago, um, I asked my wife to leave her law firm that she was at and join me. I don't do anything without running it, it, everything by her, um, as well as Larry. Uh, Larry's been my counselor with Tennessee Small Business Development Center. I guess now for close to 15 years, because when I first came to him, it took me about another year to raise the capital to do what I needed to do. Um, there, I've blown his telephone up at, <laughs> at 7 a.m. and <laughs> at, at 10 p.m. Um, uh, and I bounce it off of uh, those two as well as my dad, and I've got a couple other friends in the industry that have been in it longer than I that are real close to me that uh, I get a feel for what's going on in different parts of the country. And um, it doesn't really matter where you live to lease a bus to an entertainer, but it does tend to, have, you know, you need to have some friends in some places that are that are been doing it longer than you. So yeah. now I do bounce it off some people. 